Charlie Flight Wood. Hey, we're back with some more Quantum Quantum Quantum. Wow. Anyways, I'm gonna grab this ducky thing. Ducky? Is it a duck? I think it's uh. Maybe I can put that right there. I just started off, so it's gotta render if it takes a little bit late. Um. So this puzzle, I guess, you kind of gotta throw a box. <clears throat> um. I don't know if that crap is not necessary. Open the door, and then when the laser hits the box outside, it closes the door behind you and lets that door. So it's like a cool little puzzle of niceness. Let's keep going, I guess. Next room. Oh, another fan. Yay. Makes me so happy. Okay, let's see what do we have to do here. But I love when he throws up things. I wish I could throw up objects. That'd be sweet. I could like throw up a sucker. And then like it. Or a popsicle. Or a popsicle. <laughs> popsicle would be even better. Um, see, box, box. So, I think what I'm gonna do over here is create a little stairwell up to wherever I'm supposed to be going. Kind of like I did earlier. And, oh, that one's way up there. Great. I don't need that one. It's gay anyway. Okay. Boop. Right there. <laughs> I suck. Okay, and this one right there. Sweet! Got my little tiny... S oh, I can't get up there. It's too big of a chunk. Let me see. Um, rabbits. If a, no, it's too far away. Dang it. Ah, come on, I'm just trying to grab it. Grab that. Ah! I can stick that right there. Yes. Ah. So, sorry, I don't mean to talk about exactly what's going on the screen, but sometimes I just do that. Because I'm lazy. Oh, oh. Sweet. Is there anything over there? Like any of those knickerbobbers? Oh, no. Next room. Blasting through this. Oh, this is cool. Um, if you take these and you can change the picture by what dimension you're in. So see, now I'm like a little guy in like a dog suit, and now I'm in like a metal goth suit. I look like I'm like from the 80s and like an arena rock band or something. Not even. More like a, a kiss. It was like a kiss costume. Wow, sorry, I'm getting distracted by this. Okay, so this, this, you know how you can make things heavy and they turn like metallic? You're gonna have to do that for these lasers up here. Boom. See? Mino got hurt. Sorry, I don't like this. Usually, that was gay. I shouldn't have. Gay. Wow. I don't usually make fun of. Let's see. I'm gonna grab that little robot guy. Let me see. Wait, come. I believe I stole these and hid them at one point. He's rather fond of shiny objects. There we go. Okay, right over here. Okay. Now, throw up again. <laughs> I find the number three to be a very satisfying number. It's a Heatner number, and the proper amount of scoops on an ice cream cone. There we go. So for this puzzle, you just kind of got to stack them up. I uh, add a little, I'm going to put a little cut, like, um, I messed up. Big while I uh, accidentally paused it and then moved around after I paused, and so I'm gonna have to re put a little cut there because I start recording after that. So sorry well, about this. I could have done it better myself. Not bad though. I'm gonna have little uh, pauses of throughout the video of like maybe if I take too long in a puzzle. You may remember some of my past inventions from previous trips. This is my ice gun, Freezy Ray Vaughn. Does anyone get that joke? Ray Vaughn? No? No one? Okay. Standard <laughs> are done. Oh, I really wish I wouldn't do that. <laughs> He's riding a duck. Gimme! Give Gimme! Give I wanna get the duck. 
Maybe you can't get it. I don't know. Press this button up. Oh, God. <laughs> gimme, gimme. I'm like a little this dog. This is a compression platform which uses photoelectric energy to function. Like a spring, the energy pulses below the platform excite the molecules in the air, stimulating an elastic structural rigidity. Sometimes it says things that have big words in them, and I'm like, what? What you talking about? I love breaking glass in this game. Did I ever mention that? It's just so awesome. I hate it when things get broken. Especially my things. Shut up. Sorry, there. Yeah, sorry, I had to pause for a second and use the bathroom. Because even though I'm playing a game, I still have to use bodily functions. Especially, uh, can't even wait <laughs> five minutes into a game and I'm already gotta go pee my pants. I mean, and use the restroom. Because obviously, it would be no point to go into the bathroom if you're gonna pee your pants, anyways. Okay. Let's see, what's. I'm gonna grab that little thing I saw earlier. Ah! Oh, just hit my head. That sucked. Gimme, gimme, gimme! Ow! Oh, ow! Oh, ow! Oh. Got a raging headache. Let's see this on the bike. Careful. Oh, wait, wait. I gotta grab that box back from the other room. That I put on that button for no reason. Let's see. Just throw this out that window like a raging machine of awesomeness. Window. I guess not really a window. More of like a do not break this glass. glass. What am I thinking? Let's go. Okay. Let's see, what do we have? Ah, wait. Oh, sweet. I saw this in like the, the commercial. So, if you stick the box onto the platform and you jump on the box and then hold the weight down you can fly across ah! 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 <laughs> I guess you gotta make it fluffy first I mean fluffy after you make it happy ah, so much work. Okay, jump on heavy then fluffy ah this is kinda scary Oh, okay. I guess uh, that's not actually has a, doesn't have mass in it. There's a, uh, I guess objects in the game that you can fall right through apparently. Now I see a giant pit filled with keys. <laughs> oh, I don't know where he is. I think he's supposed to be in a dream dimension world thing. Oh, keys because. You lose keys, and it's like in the dimension where you lose things, I think. Just remember, you need enough change in the mass to build up enough mechanical energy. So, it must be like the place where all the things you lose. Think of this highly complex piece of technology as a trampoline. A double bounce could help. Come on, come on, I want to get this thing. Oh, I messed it up. There it is. Thank you. So I really think the picture thing in this game is pretty ultra cool. Where you just kind of like, uh, oop, I was getting distracted not even playing the game. Hmm, what do I do? I'll throw this in that window, I think. There we go. Oh, and right on the button. I'm pretty much an amazing aim. Just kidding, I'm... That sounded more arrogant when it came it's out. It's time to spring into action. Myself up. If anyone likes corny jokes, I'll like this game. Aren't you supposed to whistle while you work and grin and whatnot? <laughs> How could he tell I wasn't grinning? By the way, in this game, are you like eight years old? Um, if someone can answer me that, please, please answer in the comments. I can't. I'm not, I guess I could look it up, but I don't know if you're like eight years old in this game. I mean, you're like doing all these like complex puzzles. Maybe you're just really smart because you've been going to your like. Uncle's laboratory of secret evil awesomeness for a long, long time. So, answer, answer me this, riddle me this. But uh, if you know, 
Just let let me know. Yeah. I think you're supposed to be like a boy in this. Sorry. Uh, I had to go pee again. My bladder's like bursting at the limits all the time. This commentary. I drank like three cups of fruit juice before playing this. Oh, pause button. This is one of my past inventions, Joan the Jetpack. Worked just fine, except I had some serious trouble with the hover-up feature. Somewhat flammable. Some might say incendiary. You probably never saw this invention. It was my hole digger. We called it Every Day I'm Shoveling. And by we, I mean Ike. It was a little too efficient. This was the first and last time I saw it. <laughs> Whenever it went like, all the way down to the core, it just blew up. And <coughs> every day I'm shuffling. One can never be too safe. Pun, pun, pun. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for the boxes, Throw Monster. Don't look at my ear. Oh, sorry. That was a little kid. He's watching the game with me. Bouncy box. So I messed up there. Should have threw this one over first. I was quite the champion at shop put during my years in college on the track and field team. What? Okay. So uh, now I can use this one to block these lasers. I was an idiot. I'm sorry. Didn't even think before I just. So I'll do all the puzzles. Just... The electromagnetic micro reactors, or electrovats, if you're so inclined, will all require a conductive polycell. Ooh, a ball. It's a ball. I also happen to be on the basketball team as well. You may want to try the lid as a backboard. Sweet nice shot. Right in, baby. Like a basket. I'm like Michael Jordan. You called yourself a baby. <laughs> I guess I did. Okay, okay. Let's grab another ball. Ooh, they're yellow. Oh, let's look at this picture. My, what a handsome fellow. Dashing, intellectual, mustachioed. One might even say inspiring. Looks like the kind of man who could split the atom twice before breakfast. Twice. Twice. He's pretty... No, no random beatboxing. Yes. Okay. Alright, alright. Right over there. Yes. What? Uh, what's going on? Oh, whatever. I can't figure out. I've just been trying these platforms for, for... Oh, well, I'll just break this glass right here. That'd be a great idea. My goodness. Sometimes it's too Ooh, what's that? What's in here? A ball! Oh, it makes the other ball go away. Okay. Let's, uh... Oh, this is easy. I have to put that right there. So, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna, like, jump, have them both go down at the same time. I'll get on the safe suitcase and grab a ball, turn around, and throw it in like a BA basketball player. Ah! Don't let me grab it. How can... If... Okay, how can the ball not be, uh, lighter than... Safe. Uh, come on, come on. Oh, I can't grab it at all. I love the little like moaning rat mouse fluffy kitten thing over there. Shut. Come on, come on. Yes. Come on, please, please. On the rim. Yeah. I hooped it. Bows. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited.
I think I'm going to, uh, cut that out, because I just spent, like, uh, a good, like, seven minutes just trying to... Get him! Get him. <laughs> Dang it, I missed. Okay, okay. Let's try this again. Bounce me up. Ah, uh, uh, getting so angry at this game. <laughs> it makes me so. What? What was that? The ball just bouncing all over the place, just randomly. Oh, I'll go over here. Uh, okay, let's try that again. I'll catch the ball and I'll throw it in. Okay. <laughs> Crap. Okay, what do I do? Dang it. Come on, come on. Yes, no. Huh. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, okay. So I figured out that you have to fly this and grab it while you're in midair and be like, ooh, basketball player, ooh. Well played. Right in, baby. Sweet. I did that with jumping. How often do you fly through the air and throw basketball? A ball in a giant mechanical device. Five hundred. Yeah, that was awesome. I mean, how often are you that cool? <laughs> Not that often. And I can do a front flip my face. That doesn't sound good. Anyways, goodbye, guys. It's been 12 minutes, I think. Bye.